I couldn't resist making this video. Just imagine when your wife asks you. Darling, could you use your 3D printer to make me a flexible lid for my skier pots? That would be better than cellophane, wouldn't it? Well, I might have a solution. I've recently gotten to know this little blue violet whale. So let's ask it. Write me a free CAD macro to design a yogurt lid for 3 printing with a 2 mm wall thickness and a 3.5 mm diameter. Well, all right, let's go. It thinks for a bit and bam, here it is, my macro fully detailed. with comments and explanations to understand what was done. We copy it, go back to FreeCAD, create a new macro. Paste the code, save it. And now we execute it. Bam! Look at this, it does exactly what I wanted. Honestly, this is impressive. Now we can add some finishing touches, like a small ventilation hole. I took the base body in FreeCAD in the part design workshop. As usual, we select a surface, create a sketch. Define a diameter and make a pocket for the ventilation hole. Why not add a nice little detail, like a message from my wife? We go to the draft workshop, create text, choose a font. A little I love you. Oops, it's not oriented correctly. We adjust its position with the transformation tool. Change the font size. Then we switch to the part design workshop and extrude the text by one, and there it is, a little embossed volume. Honestly, not bad at all. It's worth looking into. It's open source, like FreeCAD. You can download the model and run it locally. I hope you like this little video. I think it's pretty fun.
What do you think? I'd love to hear your feedback. See you.